Yeah, first of all, write down some topics what we need to cover today. Hello? Yeah, write down some topics, yeah. uh, some some points that yeah. we need to cover today. Yeah. First is static pressure calculation for ducting. Yeah, static pressure. Calculation for ducting. Yeah. Okay, it's a, uh, we left on that. Yes, correct. We need yeah. to cover that completely. Yeah, that yeah. What is the standard static pressure? That is the external static pressure. Yeah, what yeah. we need to calculate only external static pressure, internal static pressure will be given by the any A2 manufacturer. Yeah, yeah, that's what you said. Yeah. Yes, yes. That's a fan manufacturer or mm. A2 manufacturer. Okay. Mm. And uh, second is mm. uh, a duct design. Yeah. According to Yeah. Friction loss and velocity. As per friction loss, yeah. Friction loss and velocity. Third one is air distribution product. Air distribution. Yes, air distribution product. Air distribution product, okay. Yes, that is uh, our today task. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Mm. So, <clears throat> I'll share you one uh, yeah. screen. Can you see this AutoCAD? Hello? Yeah, one minute. Yeah, yeah I can see. I can see now. Okay. So, this is AutoCAD. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, but but I am seeing very nicely this one. Huh? Very clear uh, I am seeing. Yes, yes. See, because this is nicer uh, laptop, na. Uh, oh, it okay. is, uh, it no, is, no, I it's think, very nice. Correct, it's clear. Eight, eight GB, eight yeah, GB yeah. RAM is there. So, yeah. Or if you have recorded, you can send me that one also. No problem. That I will do. No problem. Okay, that I will oh. do. Okay, so then let's not uh, wait. No yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Okay, thank so, you. So, uh, in this um, AutoCAD, yeah. Generally, what we are doing uh, by the line command, if I type L. By the yeah. line command, I can draw easily the line like yeah. this. Okay. This kind of a line you can see. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, the stream like this. So this is the line command. First of all, our mm -hmm. drawing is always in a meter or the inches. Okay. A millimeter or inches. Yeah. So that I need to set the units. Okay. So. If it is decimal, okay. And uh, here, millimeter, it is okay. So, set, yeah. set okay now. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Understood. And, uh, we, will, uh, uh, we will design a small ducting with uh, yeah. uh, one A2. So, we will definitely understand that how to calculate the external static pressure for that. Uh, okay. we calculate karenge, aise aise pe velocity leakinge on that duct. So, yeah. we can mention that velocity in our Excel sheet. Okay. And uh, next will be the Excel sheet. I'll open the Excel sheet. So both program I need to open. One is the AutoCAD, another is the Excel sheet. Excel drawing. Uh, sorry, Excel uh, sheet is there. So. Um, okay. This is the Excel sheet. I okay. Very open. good. Yeah. So serial number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Then duct type. Duct type is there. Next is in inches, the water yeah. column in inches. Uh, but directly we can convert uh, into millimeter. Into a millimeter or in inches also. Miss yeah. what? Uh, Miss what? If I have a uh, total static pressure in a Pascal. So yeah. add that all static pressure Pascal in some uh, um, uh, digit. So yeah. divide it by point, uh, sorry, multiply it by point zero zero four. That will be your uh, uh, static pressure in a water column in inches. Inches water column. Yeah, water column per hundred p per hundred per hundred feet. Okay. In inches. Ha. So need not to extend one more column. 
यहाँ पे हम लोग इसको ईच एंड एवरी पार्सल को यहाँ पे कन्वर्ट करके फिर से वही आने वाला है नो प्रॉब्लम सीधा हम वहाँ पे ये कर देंगे फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल ड्रॉ अ स्मॉल पीस ऑफ सिस्टम एक एक ऑफिस एरिया है एंड जस्ट लाइक वी डिस्कस दैट डे वेन यू डिजाइन वन डिंग ऑफिस एरिया ओके एट मीटर एट मीटर बाई सिक्स मीटर का ऑफिस एरिया है कैन यू सी ऑटो कैड नाउ या वेरी फास्ट एंड वेरी क्लियर ओके सो दिस इज ऑफिस साइज these are the cabin uh, cabin of around uh 2 meter yeah from here to here uh, yeah. cabin length is 2 meters yeah and uh, from here to here uh, 1.25 meter cabin length like this yeah also small cabins okay uh, small cabin is there yeah. another second cabin third cabin Hmm. fourth cabin fifth and sixth big cabin is will be there so one so we, two three four five six uh, uh, five cabin is there five small cabin is there and uh, one uh, one is the big director cabin is there can you see this now yeah one uh, two three four five and then one big one is said yeah so uh, draw the text like dt yeah, dt yeah. dt command will draw the text So here, this command will uh, draw the text. Text, yes. Hmm. So here will be cabin one. I'll say cabin one. A small text. Hmm. If you want to change the height of the text, it will be yeah. directly uh, change. Ch command oh. and select that, and you can change over here also. Let us take hundred uh, mm. Yes. The text height will be now hundred mm. Hundred mm. Then it will be given to given three. You're watching this, no? What I'm doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing. Okay, I'm doing. So, yes, yes. Cabin five, and I'm not naming this cabin. Just cabin yeah, yeah, four, five. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. Understood. Uh, understood. That any anything you can type it. Yeah, six, anything you can. Six cabin manager cabin yeah, yeah. whatever. Yeah, yeah. And the last one it. is uh, yeah. last one is the director cabin. So yeah. here I will just put the director cabin like this. Uh, so yeah. रिसेप्शन Yeah. So this is a small uh, office area. Correct. Okay. Yes. And here I will provide a door like this. Oh, then, then you will type door. Then the door will show, or how is it? No. Um, What command R, do you type? R. It's a R command. R command. R command. Okay. Okay. Uh, A R K. A R C. Sorry. A R C command. Yes. That is R. Oh. R command is there. So okay. Okay. Understood. Command, Thank you. Thank by you. this command and now uh, this is the partition wall yeah when you when you delete that one you type delete or how do you do it? It's just now you delete it huh trim trim 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल टी आर एंटर टी आर एंटर सेलेक्ट ऑल दिस बाई क्रॉस विंडो एंड अगेन एंटर इट विल आस्क इट विल आस्क सेलेक्ट द ऑब्जेक्ट टू ट्रीन दिस वन एंड दिस वन स्मॉलिश पैसेज फॉर दिन डायरेक्टली ड्रॉन अ स्मॉल ऑफिस एरिया ओवर हियर आई एम नॉट अ बिग आर्किटेक्ट ऑफ So five cabins, one director cabin, reception area, and workstation. Good guy. Now uh, we you said pantry or someone said storage yeah. area. Same pantry yeah. or storage area. Yeah. Why this pantry storage area generally requires to put the air conditioning unit or maybe ductable unit into that. मतलब आप ये पैंट्री में आप डक्टेबल यूनिट रख सकते हो उसको अगर आप ऊपर से सेग्रीगेशन करेंगे या तो फुल पार्टीशन द सीलिंग ऑलवेज फॉल्स सीलिंग इनटू एनी ऑफिस एरिया यस करेक्ट फॉल्स सीलिंग इज देयर सो अबो दैट अबो दैट फॉल्स सीलिंग वी कैन डिजाइन द डक्टिंग ओके वी कैन डिजाइन द डक्टिंग एंड वी कैन थ्रो दैट एयर फ्रॉम द ग्रीन understand correct so from here uh, if this is my small office area yeah. uh, what i require is the total heat load uh, entire heat load for this area yes yeah. the cfn requirement and the cooling requirement in a tarnish yeah. yeah yeah so uh, what we require is the heat load calculation for the same if yeah. this is entire cabins required heat load calculation we have we have heat load sheet for that Okay. okay later on we will learn how to design the heat loads for the entire office area okay. work stations everything okay 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 here uh, there, there is uh, something here what we required is a duct design hmm. on the pressure drop and the static pressure everything correct so i'll assume a certain cfm uh, ek ek aise cfm mein calculate karta hu or otherwise i will take the actual calculation we do that the area is there And the standard way, like either you will we we'll do like that. See, uh, see, uh, what we require is the heat load for this office area. Correct. Heat load we will learn definitely in some another topic. So according to the thumb rule, there is a uh, a certain uh, calculation is like that. If if one twenty five square feet area is there, hmm. you require one ton. Uh, without uh, height can be anything. Yeah, without height, without height. If height and standard height is there, and if height is yeah, that's standard height for this one twenty five square feet. Ah, uh, standard office height is around 
9 feet 9 feet 10 feet or maximum 12 feet will be there no uh, means uh, this uh, uh, this one to one ton pr what you said just now for uh -huh. 125 square feet area uh, uh -huh. do i take height no. no no height is not considerable at all height is it doesn't not matter it doesn't okay. matter okay. Good. okay just just thumb rule is said that mm. if you have a certain area like uh, uh, 125 square feet so yeah. you required one tr one ton. okay it okay. means one ton ac can provides mm. uh, cooling to 125 square feet area Okay. Understand? Yeah, and, understood. Yeah. And if my entire area is how much? 40 now, 40 square feet. It is? 8 meter by 40, uh, 40 square meter into 10.76. It's a 40, 40 square meter. Is that? Yeah. 40 square meter is the area. Yeah. So, if 40 square meter is the area, uh, what we can do is... 40, it's about 400, uh, approximately we can take about 400. 10.76, that is 430. Yeah, yeah 430. It's a 430 square feet. Yeah. If it is 430 square feet. Yeah. So divided, divided by, by 125. One, correct, correct, correct. We get number of, uh, number of TR. TR, 3.5. It is around 3.5. Okay. Standard standard duct uh, standard ductable units comes yeah. in a range like the 3 dr 4 dr hmm. so then we'll go for 4 dr here yeah so. we can go yeah. for 4 dr so go for 4 dr and now, uh, sorry sorry yeah tell me, tell sorry me. Uh, don't say sorry you can ask me anything. no this is a culture actually we have adopted when okay, you are talking this. and wow. uh, i am disturbing yeah. you that oh, means okay. uh, it's a culture which it's we have okay. adopted yeah okay, okay. yeah so 4 tr is so, equivalent to because normally in africa and other uh, countries uh, uh, they normally they don't when you talk about tr they uh, don't understand they understand in btu british thermal unit okay okay british thermal unit so just conversion factor just i was asking uh, 1 tr is equal to 12000 btu Okay, okay. One one TR equals to twelve thousand BTU. This yeah. they will understand. Okay, so this if it is, is what 40, they understand actually. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. So it is four four TR that will be forty eight thousand BTU. Yeah. Forty eight thousand BTU per hour. They always yeah. say it's per hour. Yeah. Okay. So cooling, per hour. Yeah. So cooling is always in a BTU per hour, and hmm. that is twelve thousand BTU. For 12, one TR. BTU, yeah. For one TR. One TR is equal to twelve thousand BTU. Understand? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. Thank you. Thank so you. So four thousand. For, for, sorry, 48,000 BTU will be there. Yeah. And uh, what I require is uh, that 1 TR, uh, sorry, 4 TR AC has how much uh, CFM? As I told you, 1 yeah. TR is equal to 400 CFM. Yes, yes. 1 TR is equal to 400 CFM. It means yeah. 4 TR is equal to how much CFM? That oh, will be 1600. 1600 CFM. So my... Uh, so my unit will be <coughs> capacity of 4 TR mm. and CFM capacity will be 1600 CFM. Correct. 1600 CFM. That is that. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So what I want is this capacity A2 or the ductable unit. Okay. Yeah. You can call this A2 or ductable unit or ductable A2, whatever you can call it. Ductable okay. unit or ductable A2. Uh, अगर जो A2 बोलते हैं तो ductable बोलने की जरूरत नहीं होती है। अगर AC unit बोलते हैं तो we required ductable A2 or sorry ductable AC or the yeah. normal AC without yeah. that. Yeah. So here I will provide the ductable AC. Hmm. Uh, let us take A2. Let us take A2. Yeah. So uh, we need to find out the uh, static pressure required for that A2. Yeah. Static pressure for the fan. Fan ka jo bhi static pressure hai, wo hume nikalna hai. Understand? Yeah, yeah. A2 has a static pressure. For example, 4DR A2 ka mein yahan pe randomly size banata hun 1200 by 750. That is 750 comma 1200 so this is my a2 so we are getting this 4 tr a2 is it right 
था फोर्टीआर एचू फोर्टीआर एचू का जो भी साइज होगा वो साइज हमें यहाँ पे डालना है वी कैन टेक दिस साइज फ्रॉम द कैटलॉग ऑल्सो कैटलॉग Now, uh, because you did calculation of twelve hundred by seven fifty, yeah. Hmm. Twelve hundred by seven fifty is the size of that AHU. Oh, twelve hundred by seven fifty is the size of the AHU. Size of the yes. Okay. Yes, okay. Understood. Size understood. Of, understood. Size of the AHU or that uh, size is the vary according to the catalog of the yes manufacturer. and manufacturer. Uh, some manufacturer provides like a uh, thousand by uh, uh, six thousand by six hundred. So AHU size will be like this. Okay, understood. Yes, I will rotate this. So here, thousand uh, or six hundred by thousand is there. Okay. Hmm. So here, I'll put on the in the pantry. In the pantry. Okay. Yes. I'll set the layer for that A two. Uh, I'll say A two. Like this. Uh, this is my layer setting. So But I didn't understand about layer. Kindly, if you can explain wait, me about layer. Yeah. Layer is what uh, is. Uh, I need to design uh, entire drawing in a uh, different lines, length, and uh, different colors. Colors okay. is there. Oh, layer. Okay. Uh, colors is there. Lines are there. So uh, oh. we using the Uh, we designing the multiple services in a same drawing. For example, if I'm talking about only HVAC, uh, there is the A two is there, piping is also there, ducting is there, cable okay, okay. is also so, there. Yeah. Uh, outdoor yeah, is also there. Yeah. To show it there. in a different color. Yeah. Yes, and for that we we need to design the entire HVAC system in a different color. If I'm using the uh, layer. And I have set this cyan right. color for this layer, and the line will be continuous. I will change this in, uh, huh. in a cyan. Yeah. So directly yeah, it will, you can see it will see in a cyan color. Line to that cyan yes, color. Yes, yes. Yeah. Cyan color. Now this is my standard cyan, and the rest of the area, uh, I uh, architectural layer is also there, like wall. Yeah. I'll Understood. See Architect wall. Mm. So, if architect wall is there, mm. and uh, I will say that architect wall in this color, in a different color, understood. Different Very color. Good. Thank so, you. this will come in a architect wall like this. Yeah. Now you can see this Correct. partition. I will uh, design in a uh, some another layer, and uh, I'll say partition. Okay. So, if partition is there, take yeah. some different color like this. If if it is a glass partition, yeah, this kind of a color you can change one ninety two any color you can take. There is no hard and fast rule that you have to take this color and uh, that color. So this is my partition color. This okay. is the partition. Okay, understood. Understood. Furniture another color will be there. That will be furniture, and uh, let us say this gray color for the furniture. That is. Yeah. ग्रीन कलर ग्रीन कलर If it is uh, fresher ducting, fresher duct uh, requires for that A two. I will uh, in this color. You know, okay. Okay. Thirty color. Okay. 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 So if I need to design the ducting, simply yeah. set that layer as a current layer. For example, supply air color, uh, supply duct. I set it as a current. So okay. By double click, you can. Set as a color, or from here. Yeah, yeah. New, okay, 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 okay. Understood. Wait, wait. You understood, na? No? Yes. Like that only. So yeah. I have set it supply air duct in a current layer. So anything you will draw, you will draw on that supply air duct layer. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Now here, if this is my standard A two size, 
Yeah. From behind, you need to put a 300 mm from the wall. Yeah, the space we need to give. Space. Because we mm. need to operate the filter, we need to take the filter down. Yeah, and clean it yeah and cleaning everything. It. For servicing. For service for purpose. Servicing. And from this side, yeah. I need 250 mm, that is 10 inch. Because wall station is also there. Yeah, yeah. You know, walls is there, strainer mm. is there. So for that, I require to put uh, at least 10 inch from the side, mm. from the side wall. Okay. Yeah, yeah. This is my partition. This is minimum, yeah? Yes, yes, yes. This is minimum. Okay. This is my partition. And mm. the partition has a 75 mm thickness from here to here. That is also 300, 300 front side. Uh, from front side, it not required 300. And that we are leaving it open. Yes, yes, yes. We are leaving it open. Yeah. Okay. Now, this is the standard uh, uh, AHU I have installed here. Yeah. With some standard space planning. Okay. Now, if this is my AHU, mm. what are uh, the capacity of AHU I need to mention on this? Yeah. 40R. Ah, 40. Okay. 40R and CSM is 1600. Yeah. Selection cursor is a very small. Okay. Ah, so, what I will do, option me, okay. Hmm. I will select the selection cursor. Hmm. Big thing to make it. So here selection and hmm. pixel box is like this. Yeah. And drafting auto snap will be like this. Okay. Apply, apply. So it's looking big some. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Now yeah. It's okay. Uh, here will be the mouthpiece. Mouthpiece is totally dependent upon the catalog that what you're using. Uh, if, if I'm using Blue Star A2, Pass yeah. A2 is there. Yeah. Um, multiple uh, LG, uh, then uh, you know, uh, Train A2 is also there. These are some companies who are manufacturing A2. Uh, which is the best actually? Which is the company best? You yeah, according to uh, your according to me. Uh, hmm. Uh, standard general in our India, we are using Blue Star. Blue Star. Blue Star. Yes. Okay. Blue Star. Blue Star. Blue Star is there. Okay. And uh, system wise, if you go for DX ductable, see this system is a DX. DX ductable okay. system is there. DX means what? Direct expansion. Direct system. expansion. Yeah. And uh, uh, that this direct expansion, there is the indoor unit at the same capacity outdoor unit will be there. Yeah, yeah. It means 4 TR indoor unit, the same 4 TR outdoor unit capacity unit will be there at the outside. Means yeah, what? Yeah. If this is the outside area of the uh, office here, yeah. uh, at the corner somewhere here or yeah. uh, somewhere here, mm. I'll put the outdoor unit like this. Yeah. And the piping will be like this from yeah. here to here. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We will design the entire office system sometimes. No problem. Okay, no problem. Okay. So, uh, this is my uh, ducting design. Okay. 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 Take light when it market Okay. Now, uh, hmm. let's start the ducting first. Okay. 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 Uh, I'm uh, downloading one software that is duct sizer because. Yes. Yeah. I think I he gave me this one. 
I have also second. here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, the other day. That, that, that day he has it on his laptop, I think. He has it on his laptop. This uh, laptop, if it is his. Wait, I just find it out. Huh? Wait, okay. Wait. okay. Wait, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Can you see the step size now? Yes, yes, I am seeing. Yeah. So if it is sixteen hundred CFM, yeah, yeah. and uh, head loss, uh, standard head loss, that is the constant point friction. Zero, yes, constant point friction zero, loss. Zero, point zero eight, you had said. Point zero eight. Let us take point zero uh, eight. Okay. Yeah. If it is point zero eight, the velocity will be nine seventy six. That is thousand cfpm. Yeah. Okay. And now here. What I need is to put a uh, depth size for the height. Yes. Uh, for example, if I put the height yeah, right. like this, uh, three hundred that is twelve inch. Yeah, okay. So if it is twelve inch, the yeah. width will be twenty two. Yeah. Twenty two. So twenty two by twelve is there. Now here is this duct sizer is also available in a units okay metric if i set in yeah. the metric unit it will, it will be directly automatically like this yeah yeah okay 300 by 550 300 by 550 velocity will be 4.9 that is 5 yeah. 5 meter per second yeah so just put directly mm. change the units so automatically entire calculation will be the change okay. mm. Understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, if this is a, if a standard, if the flow rate is sixteen hundred, and the head loss is point zero eight, then the velocity comes in a meter per second. Meter per second. Yeah. Something is wrong here. Yeah. Uh, here I have designed 1600 and mm. the velocity I have 0.08. 0.08. Yeah. And uh, this is the standard velocity I have. And if yeah. I change the unit, it's changing Little. something. Like yeah, no, no, it is in it is it is a liter per second. Yeah, yeah, that is in liter per. It second. is an IP here. Yeah. Uh, uh, so. Uh, Liter per second means what? Uh, one CFM is equal to 0.47 liter per oh, second. Oh, oh, let me know now. One CFM equals to 0.47. 0 0.47 liter per, per second. Uh, 47. 0.47 liter per second. That is the half. Okay. Uh, you can easily see this. Uh, okay, okay. 1600 okay. divided by. Uh, uh, 1600 multiplied by. Yeah. Multiplied multiplied by 0.47. Okay, sixteen hundred multiplied by point four seven. That is seven. Correct. Seven fifty two. So here is seven fifty five. It's there. Okay. Yeah. So if I am uh, convert this entire calculation into metric, so yeah. this will come like this. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now you can directly go with this calculation also. Yes. Each time. 1600 CFM to convert liter per second mein. that is one mm. thing so another entire system will come Matlab aapko meter per second directly mil yeah, yeah. and size will automatically get okay yeah. so 1600 CFM is there huh? yeah, yeah. and uh, let's come to the AutoCAD in the AutoCAD 1600 CFM is the starting duct CFM so yeah. uh, what was uh, that my five fifty three hundred by five fifty three hundred by five fifty is there. Yeah. So if it is three hundred by five fifty, so directly five fifty divided by two, that is a half of yeah half this side half this side yeah okay. So uh, this is my duct. This is my uh, uh, what yeah. I said outlet mouthpiece yeah. mouthpiece yeah okay from here. Uh, 
I will show some, you know, uh, some design like uh, trapezoid. The one which you. Canvas connection. Oh, okay, okay. Canvas connection. Connection between uh, the metal thing, metal and the yes, metal to, metal. Op, to avoid vibrations. And from here, it is 500 taper length. From here to here. Or let us take 300 also. 300 also is enough. Okay. Here to here. And put the taper from here to here. And here to here. The taper will be like this. Okay. Okay. So this is what? Um, so, uh, so if the if the AHU mouthpiece is bigger than the uh, duct, then, then the we are opposite. Then taper will be like opposite. this. Opposite. 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 Yes, yeah. yes, yes. When chota taper, मतलब छोटा mouthpiece दिया है, तो taper ऐसे okay. आएगा. Okay. And uh, the standard. Uh, Size, I'll mention here mm. that is 550 by 300. Correct? 550 by 300. Yeah, that. You can change the text height here. Yeah. So, multi touch. Yeah, yeah. And gap made it. Yeah. So, uh, this is the size, and we need to mention the CFM also. Yeah. That is how much? 1600 CFM yeah. KDA. This is the size. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, let's start my uh, ducting distribution. Distribution okay. is like this. Key yeah. मैंने यहाँ से एक डक्ट ये किया है, डिजाइन किया है, and it is going here. Okay. आ यहाँ से टर्न मार के यहाँ पे जाएगा और यहाँ पे एंड यहाँ पे उसका ये देगा वो फ्लो देगा. Okay. The flow will be like this. I'll show you. Okay. This is five fifty. For the 550 over here. This is all adjustment exercises. Okay, I'll okay. show you. Okay. Here. I directly turn my duct, uh, main duct from here to here. So if I design the duct like this, I can split my duct here as well as here okay okay and i'll put one duct here another duct here to yeah. feed up all this workstation as well as this cable okay, okay. okay. up to here up to director cable yeah my main duct will be here like okay. this i'll show you the size of the duct will be vary according to the CFM distribution. Okay. So this is my duct end. Yeah, yeah. I have a location, I have a single line, so the duct size change. Okay, fine. Okay. 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 And okay. Uh, from here, there is the, like this, from here to here. Okay. Now, uh, 1600 CFM is there. Sorry, I need to minute. provide, yeah, Hello? this is my uh, standard, um, you know, uh, single line. Yeah. This, okay. Yes, yes, yes. Now, let's start with this. And yeah. whenever I change uh, this, uh, I want uh, workstation to be fed by the cool air. 
Okay. So here I'll put one diffusers like this. Wind the diffuser here. Yeah. As well as here. Yeah. So uh, this is my duct design, a simple duct design. Yeah. And in this, uh, I will put the rectangular diffuser in this. Okay. So for example, my rectangular diffuser is 450 by so 50 by 450. It will be like this. 50 by 450 or maybe you can take a 300 by 300 depending upon the entire uh, uh, CFM. If your CFM 300 hai, uh, sorry, aapka CFM, whatever your distribution is there. Abhi okay. ye workstation mein I need to distribute the air according okay. to the area. Okay. Area. Uh, 1600 is in my hand and per square feet, uh, this is total square feet is how much? Uh, total so this is uh, 430. 430. 430 square feet is there. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. It mm. means you, you are giving this diffuser for this area, is it right? The workstation area. Yes, so then we actually we calculate the area of that workstation area. Yeah, correct. 16, 16, yeah, correct. 1600 is the total CFM. Yeah. Uh, divided by 450. It yeah. means one square feet requires 3.5 CFM. Yeah. Correct. No? Yeah, correct. 4, 430, na? sorry. 430, yeah, 430. Yeah, yeah. Yes, 1600 is there. 1600 divided by 430. 430. So, one square feet required 3.72. 3.7? 2. Is that yeah, so, no? 3.72. 1600 hmm. divided by 430. So, hmm. wait. 1600. divided by 430, so 3.72 per square feet area is there. Yeah, and per now, square meter, so, sorry, square feet. Square, correct, correct. square feet. Correct. So correct. if, so if this workstation area is around yeah. this one, this is how much? It's about 18.2. 18. 18.3. 18. 18. Yeah, 18.3. Okay, 18.3. Mm. If it is 18.3, then 18.3 multiplied by 10.76. Mm. So it is 196.9, 197. 197 is the area. Square feet, yeah. Square feet. Mm. Multiply by 3.72. 3 3.72. That is 3730. 730. Uh, okay. okay. Seven, yeah, 732. So, let us say 750. Okay. So, entire area workstation requires 750 CFM. Yeah. Correct? Yeah, yeah. 750 CFM. Yeah. Now, if it is 750 CFM, if I divide it by 125, each diffuser, I will select 125 CFM. So I need six six diffuser in the, into this area. No, sorry, uh, a 750 CFM. Uh -huh. So it, each diffuser is 125 CFM. CFM. I just yeah. put. But up, up, we be CFM. Us me dal sakte hai, and uh, our so, time will be uh, according to our yeah. CFM. 300 by 300 uh, millimeter uh, standard uh, diffuser. Yes. Can provide about, hmm. 120 CFM. 125 CFM. 125 CFM, correct. Okay. Yeah, now yeah. the now the size of the diffuser, uh, I will show you in the next topic that how okay. to design the diffuser. No problem. Okay. No problem. No problem. So here is the six square six square diffuser. I'm I'm selecting six yeah, yeah. square diffuser. Yeah. And 300 by 300 is the size. So rectangle. 120 uh, sorry, 300 and 300 by 300. So this is my diffuser. I am seeing calculator only, sorry. Just a minute. Hmm. Yeah. Angle, that is 300 by 300 is there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And do one thing here. It is hmm. um, 75. 
37.5 like this so this is my diffuser looks like this ye apna diffuser se dikhta hai okay this is what uh for example if i have 125 wait i'll show you a small calculation of the duct uh, sorry the diffuser selecting if 125 is there yeah. divided by velocity that is 400 yeah okay your voice is coming very low uh, hello okay can you hear you can hear me yeah divided by 4 so this, this is the area of the diffuser 0.3 Okay, divided again point ten point seven six. This is the point zero two nine square meter area of the diffuser, and I will directly convert it into. Oh, okay, okay. You are gone. Uh, you, you are done. Square like this one, yeah. square. So this is point seventeen, means one seventy mm. Yeah. So standard, I have taken three hundred by three hundred. That is the standard. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Standard is starting. The next piece, next size is starting from 150 also, yeah. and next will be 225. Okay. It means this is 225. See, you can see here 225. I'm start. seeing only calculator. Yeah, just a minute. If this is 225, yeah, this is our next size actually. Okay. Oh. Okay. This is our outer size. I'll show you that how the duct, uh, how the square diffuser looks like. अभी फिलहाल के लिए ये रखते हैं. Yeah, yeah, this is fine. Yeah. इसका square diffuser का मैं ये बनाता हूँ क्या? Block बना लेता हूँ. The block will be like this. Okay. Now this is the block. Put this block here. Six diffusers I require. So, so, so we, we divide this one into those areas. Yes, yes. Equally, yes. huh? Equally. Here. And here. For this entire workstation area. Okay. Yeah. Now here, what you have done is two in the middle. Yes. And yes. the two is whatever the remaining gap is there. Yes. I can yes. place remaining two more. Yeah. Yes. Or is it okay? Or because uh, uh just put this three diffusers like hmm. x by 2 hmm. this what if you are uh this distance is around 6250 hmm. can you see here 6250 is your distance yeah so divide it into three diffuser how to divide like this hmm. 6250 divided by 3 this is 2083 Again divided by two, that is one zero four zero. From here, start with one zero four zero. So your first diffuser bit will come here only. Yeah, I'm seeing calculator. If you can remove that. Ah, oh, just a minute. What I said one zero four zero. Yeah. So from here one zero four zero will be here. So your mm. first diffuser come here. Mm. Next diffuser will be uh, multiply by one zero four zero into two. That is two zero eight three. So two zero eight three will be our second diffuser. So it will be come here. Mm. Our third diffuser will be two zero eight three again. Two zero eight three. to be here yeah correct and <coughs> divide this also from here to here that is how much yeah. 2950 so yeah. what i will do divide by 2 uh, uh, 2950 divide by 2 yeah what if you there is there na so yeah. 147 again divide by 2, 2. so 737 737 understood so from here just put one line and yeah. 737 is there from here to here yeah correct so my uh, hmm. all diffusers will come on this line yeah our screen ko minimize kar yes sir okay okay hmm. 
ठीक है सो हियर दिस विल बी डायरेक्टली कम ऑन दिस एंड दिस इज 737 मल्टीप्लाई बाय 2 दैट इज 1474 मिनिमाइज करने के बाद भी मुझे एवरी टाइम न्यू शेयर करना पड़ता है ओके सो कम हियर हियर बी कम सो आई हैव जस्ट डिवाइड दिस डिफ्यूजर्स ऑन इक्वी डिस्टेंस ओके प्लेस दिस डिफ्यूजर इनटू इक्वी डिस्टेंस ओके बट copy this directly yeah yeah and it is correct yes but but this this is come on our own unit yes. so isko thoda sa aap ye kar sakte hain shift kar sakte hain shift kar sakte hain uh like this ki aapko kya karna hai or we can remove one by increasing or is it uh, just put this shift this depth first because okay. ye bhi uh एल्बो के ऊपर आ रहा है विच इज नॉट एक्सेप्टेबल योर डक्ट इज ऑल बिगर डिफ्यूजर इज ऑलवेज अंडर स्ट्रेट डक्ट ओके एंड अवर इट विल कम अवर मेन टू अवर डिफ्यूजर विल कम हियर पुट दिस स्लाइडली नो प्रॉब्लम कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं ओके आप यहां पे रख सकते हैं या या एंड दिस विल बी लाइक दिस सो हियर हियर हैज दिस इज ऑल एक्स्ट्रा लाइंस दैट वी ड्रॉप हियर स्कोर वाइज कर सकते हैं दिस विल बी ओके ओके नो हियर अ जो दिस इज वॉट आई से कितना लिया था हमने सिक्स हंड्रेड के लिए सिक्सटीन हंड्रेड के लिए दिस इज माई फोर पॉइंट नाइन मीटर पर सेकेंड सो यहाँ पे वेलोसिटी लीक दो राइट डाउन वेलोसिटी अदर यू नो थोड़ा अलग कलर से लिख दो व्हाट आई टोल्ड यू कॉपी करके सेम टेक्स्ट को कॉपी करके नीचे ये उसको यू कैन फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड ना इट इज फाइव फोर पॉइंट नाइन होना है फाइव अराउंड फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड कलर यू कैन डील एनीथिंग ओके सो इट्स कैन बी uh you know uh, different shade color so this oh. is 5 meter per second now each diffuser may say mm. what we are 125 125 distribute kar diya oh. we have distributed 125 plus 125 to this workstation area yeah then we minus that one. Yeah. yes we can minus that so my total is 1600 cfm minus 125 minus 125 it will be 1350 yeah <coughs> so my next we calculate the duct size as per 1350 okay this is point that is that area uh 1350 no yeah now you need to go to units and then uh, change it ha you can change metric uh, say cha ye us uh 1350 if it is 1350 and the head loss is the standard 0.06 mm. constant head loss will be there mm. velocity is comes here this is the velocity now if yeah. you want to change the velocity uh, in a meter per second that is how much 1 cfm is equal to how much uh, fpm 1 cfm equals to how much fpm sorry 1 cfm equals to you said f sorry one uh, sorry one fpm is equal to how much meter per second so one fpm equals to uh, this is feet so feet means uh, uh, one minute one minute uh, I, i give you one uh, uh, one divided by uh, feet into 3 point 
to eight meter mm, divided by into divided by sixty. So I'm just giving you uh, one divided by one. Minute. I'm just calculating. Sorry. Yes, yes, sure. You can absolutely. Yes. You are going in a very fantastic way. Yeah. And why? Because no student, my student, always you know taking the randomly figure or the figure which I am telling him. But you, yeah. as you are calculating, that is very fantastic. I mean, I yeah. really appreciate it. Uh, yeah. One feet divided by meter. Yeah. That is meter is how much? One FPM equals to 0 0.05. One feet is equal to how much? 300 mm. Uh, one feet yes. equals 300 mm. So that is 0.3 meter. Yeah. Correct. Yeah, correct. So 0.3 yeah. multiply by. Uh, divide. We have to divide this one, man. Right? FPM. Uh -huh. We have to divide this one too so that we calculate into meter, man. Right? Uh, one meter per second we are doing. Uh, one meter per second. Uh -huh. Well, then you will multiply. Now we are calculating one FPM uh -huh. equals to one. How many? How much a meter per second? That's what we are doing. Yes, so yes, then yes. we need to divide. This one. Correct. Yeah, Sorry. Yeah, we need to divide it. Yeah. Uh, so it's coming to somewhere around because one minute second. One minute is uh, FPM. Minute is 60, yeah? So, 60 second, six sec 60 seconds. 60 seconds. Meter is how much? One feet is equal to 300, 0.3 meter. Yeah. Yeah. So, that is how much? So 0.3 divided by 60 directly. My my calculation came to some uh, somewhere around 0 0.035. No. 0, 0, 005. Yes, 0 0.005. Correct. Yeah, that's what I have calculated. See, directly what you have to calculate like this. Point mm. 0.3. That is the yeah. meter. Yeah, yeah. Divided by 0 0.60. Yeah. Simple. Yes. It's a point zero zero 0.005. Correct. That's so, what I if, so if I have 1350, yeah. so look at here, look at the screen. Yeah, yeah. I can see calculator. Yeah. So multiply it by 1350. Yeah. That is 6.75. Understand? Yeah, yeah. So it means if here, if here, you have 1350 CFM, then your size will be your size will be we are doing 300 that is let us say uh, 300 by 20 19 into 2.54 it will be 20 correct now yeah yeah so size will be 20 by 300. Okay. 20 is how much? 500. Yeah. Okay. So sorry, you... I think uh, sorry, yeah. No. That is 19 inches has come, man. Eh? Ah, so 19 into 2.54, about 48. So 482 millimeter. 19 inches means. 19 inches means how much? 480. Ha ha, that is okay. So I'm just you know putting round figure. Okay. okay. You can say 450 also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 500. Okay, okay. Understood. Understood. You can say 40, uh, like 450. Let, okay. Let's take 450 over here. 450 yeah, yeah, by 300 is the size. Okay, correct. And uh, what is what is our this one? Velocity. Okay. What velocity we have uh, derived? What is the velocity? 4.7. 4.7, correct? No? 4.7. Yeah, See here. Why uh, directly? It was. Uh, 
it was in a 1350 na no? yeah correct and the velocity was uh, this one uh, so you can directly this convert into velocity uh, like yeah. 0.005 karke multiply karke you can convert or yahan se main convert karta hu like metric ka kar dunga to 4.7 Yeah, yeah. So 4.7. Here is the velocity 4.7. Yeah, yeah. 4.7 meter per second. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And uh, my duct size again reduced by yeah. 450. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Can I only ah, minimize? Ah, ah, ah. Yeah. 450 both side. This one and this one and three okay. fifty is the paper. Yeah. After straight piece, draw the taper. So here will be three fifty taper. It will be like this from here to here and uh, here to here. Mm. And trim all these uh, lines like this. Okay. So here is. My duct size and velocity for this. Mister, uh, one side we can keep when we are making duct. One side we can keep it straight or taper, or do we make it taper both sides? Both side, one side maybe they can take, both side maybe they can take. But it totally depend upon that. If we go, where to go? Okay, fine. Okay, we 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 are going both side, so that's why my taper is the essential okay. concentrate. Uh, uh, टेपर Now come to our this one main distribution main Excel sheet. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Can you see this now? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So first is our taper. Second is our straight duct. Yeah. Third is also our taper. Yeah. Fourth is our straight duct. Yeah. ये चारों का करना है ओके या दैट दैट एल्बोस वी आर नॉट कंसीडरिंग द एल्बोस एल्बो इज आल्सो देयर ओके वी विल कंसीडर दैट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल कम टू दिस टेपर यू कैन सी द ड्राइंग ना या या आई कैन सी दिस इज माय टेपर एंड द टेपर साइज दिस साइज इज 550 This width is a 550, yeah. whereas height I will take from here. So this yeah. jo height hai, iska, hmm. uh, ye let us take 300. Let us okay. take 300 is the height. So yeah. if uh, taper uh, width is the 550, whereas the height is 300. 300. Perimeter just like yesterday. Yeah. Uh, first of all. Sorry. Just we add the uh, width and the height multiplied by two. Yeah. Yes, two. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Plus the height. Yeah. This is my perimeter. Correct. Seventeen hundred. But I divide it by thousand to get into the meter. Meter. Yeah. One point seven is the meter. Correct. Is equal to. Uh, I have done this wrong. Height is required. First of all, the length. Length. Oh, yeah. Length in meter has yes. to come. Yes. Length in meter. Correct. Oh, this is in a square meter. Area will be in a square meter like this. Length. Yeah. Meter like this. Now, uh, what is the length? Hmm. From here to here. You can see three hundred mm is the length. No, it has. Okay. 
300 mm as a length so directly point point 3 multiply by point 3 mm. area is so much multiplication of both multiplication of both this one and this one this is the surface area what we required is the surface area for static yes. pressure understand yeah. because yeah. our air is always going or flowing inside that surface that touch the surface yes and because the we, when it is touched the surface surface its hmm. pressure will always drop okay yeah. Yeah. that's why we need to calculate the area surface area Correct. of the duct yeah. then the standard pressure drop point 0.08 Point zero eight, but I here what I required is in a meter, meter in yeah. a mm. Yeah, mm. So yes. directly it will be comes in a mm in a metric, and and meter per second. That is the five. First is the five. Yeah. So pressure is multiplied by area. Multiply by area. Pressure drop and develop. In all three multiplication of all. Multiply by this. Yeah, it will be point two. Yes. So it is in mm only. Extremely yeah. sorry for that. Yeah, one point two five. For that, is it one point two five? So yeah. So this is three point one eight. Okay. Yesterday we have calculated that. Yeah. This is a table. Straight piece. Straight yeah. piece. The size of the straight piece is also same. Five fifty by three hundred. Yeah. And a perimeter. In a meter. Yeah. The length we need to calculate for the drawing. Yeah, from the drawing. Perimeter, one point seven, and okay. here just mm -hmm. control D. So mm -hmm. automatically uh, it will uh, display. Yes, it will copy. Copy. Length is how much? If it is straight piece, yeah. Your length is starting from here. Yeah. Like I will uh, draw. And dimension dimension linear dimension from mm -hmm. here to here this is how much two one six nine it's a two one six nine yeah. set the dimension like this Mm. Modify, go to text. That is one twenty five, and the uh, arrow one twenty five. It will be shown like this. automatically it does. Huh? Yes. Block. Yes. You have created that one as a block. Yes, yes, yes. Two one six nine. Two one six nine means approximately two point two. Let us say yes. two point two meter is the yeah yeah length. So okay. if this is there. The length will be two point two, correct? Yeah, correct. The straight piece length will be two point two meter, Automatic and the area is multiplied. Uh -huh. Multiplied by this. Yeah. Uh, you can directly copy the calculation or the formula yeah, which is above. Yeah. Okay. So this is yeah. the formula. Pressure drop. Uh, same, same. Constant pressure drop. Yeah. From here to here on each yeah. there will be one point twenty five. Yeah. Yeah. One point uh, one point twenty five. The standard pressure drop will be there. Yeah. Okay. So here velocity that is four point seven velocity is yeah. there as yeah. we have calculated that. So yeah. it will be directly formula twenty one point yeah. nine. Correct. Okay. okay. So this is the Pascal pressure for that duct. Right. Yeah. Next will be elbow. Yeah. Uh, next is not taper; it is elbow. elbow. Yeah. And for that elbow, this is where size will be the same. Yeah. Five fifty. You can see the elbow size is the same. Yeah. This is the elbow size. Okay. And the size of the elbow is the same. That is five fifty by three hundred. Yeah. So five fifty by three hundred perimeter. So we are taking this one like. Uh, Because when it is uh, elbow, elbow ninety degree elbow is there. Huh, But for the one thing I I must uh, tell you, if I am uh, 
if straight duct is there your pressure drop is 1.25 uh, 1.25 but but that is 0 0.08 but yeah. if it is elbow the pressure drop will be more more yeah that will okay. be 0.1 so if it is 0.1 if it is 0.1 then we can directly multiply it 0.1 multiply by how much 25 that yeah. is 2.5 so, here we have 2.5 instead of 1. Uh, that is uh, pressure drop in uh, mm. Correct, no? Mm. Yeah. Uh, let's see, I'll explain to you. If it is a straight duct, our standard pressure drop is 0.08. Mm. If it is elbow, there will be more pressure drop. Yes. And that pressure drop will be, let us standard pressure drop in an elbow and mm. in a taper or also. Uh, it is taking 0 0.1, 0 0.1. So if it is 0 0.1, then mm, it will be 2.5, correct? Mm. Yeah. The taper of the, we need to change then, I think. Yes, yes. Ha, taper we need to change, that is yeah. 2.5. Yeah, I'm seeing calculating now. Yeah. 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 For taper, I have changed. That is 2.5, 1.25, yeah. elbow 2.5. Yeah. Okay. Length of the elbow is how much? Length of the elbow same is... Same is same, both of them. Yeah. Because yeah. when you talk about elbow... Huh. The length of same. the elbow... Nee, width, width is a 500. Yeah. Height is a 300. Uh, okay. height, height of the elbow is 500. We, uh, sorry, width yeah, also width. has to be same in the elbow. Yeah. yeah. Width of the elbow is 500. Height is 300. But oh, length... But okay, okay. Understood. Understood. Length. Length Understood. is different. Length yeah. is what? Uh, from here yeah. to here. There is the yeah. length. Elbow yeah. also has a length. Like, like yeah. taper, straight yeah. piece. So elbow also has a length. Okay. So what is the length of the... What, what we need to consider the elbow length? And uh, this is... Whatever uh, the uh, last maximum. area is there. Yes, maximum. We, maximum we, every, we take average of this? Or maximum yes, uh, uh, Or we, maximum is correct? Maximum so. is correct. We are yeah. always taking the maximum because our air is traveling to the maximum side. surface yes. side. Yes. That's yes. why we need to take this maximum, uh, maximum length that is one point. Uh, here it is, you can see 1021. Yeah. That is one meter. Let us right. take one meter. If yeah. it is one meter, yeah. I'll take here length is one meter. Mm. Area by putting control D. Yeah. Formula will copy that is 1.7 directly. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. It is the perimeter formula, it is the area square meter formula, yeah. and pressure drop is 2.5. Yeah. And the velocity is important. Now what yeah. is now the we velocity? need to go to size and calculate. Yes, yes, yes. So here, so uh, our standard velocity for 1600 was 0 0.08, correct? Yeah. Uh, 0.08. Hmm. And uh, now, if I change this, yeah. uh, we minus that is same. the same. same. It is, yeah, it's 13, same. 1300, 1350 same. Uh, no, uh, see, uh, up to here, I mean, uh, okay, up correct. to here, we have 16, 1600 only because yeah, 1350 mm -hmm. is here only. So yeah, for correct. 1600 and yeah. for for the elbow, for the elbow, 1600, you can take yeah. 1600, but yeah. here, head loss will be 0.1. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So, this is our velocity. Yeah, correct. But, you can directly convert this velocity, 1067 by, uh, by, by 0 0.005. What was, yeah. what was, what is that? I just <coughs> Calculate that. Yeah. Sorry. And this is one zero seven. I just take round figure one zero seven zero mm. into point zero five. No, no, point zero zero five. Five, yeah, correct. Sorry, point zero zero five. Five point three five. Five point three five. Yes. Yeah. So directly, uh, you can draw here. Sorry. Here. What is that? Hmm. Point three five three five. Yeah. Okay. Control D. So here it is your pressure drop 
or yeah. the static pressure in a pascal in a elbow that yeah. is maximum 22 because yeah. directly you put the 90 degree elbow that's why yeah yeah okay hmm. next next is next the is straight, the straight. straight yeah, it's a small straight piece okay hmm. so what is the distance of that small what is the distance of this small? Uh, 200. It's uh, 100, I think. I think 100. Okay. It's uh, 100 only. Okay. 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 No problem. So here, right. come in our calculation sheet, straight straight duct, same 550 by 300. And here is the perimeter. Yeah. Okay. Here is the length 0 0.1 mm. meter. Area in square meter, this point 17, 1.25, mm. and velocity is the next velocity that is. You uh, need to calculate the same. Ah, not oh, same. That is 1600.08, no? Yeah, 16, uh, that we need to go to the sizer and calculate. Yeah? Again. Directly take 4.7, 4. no? Directly take 4. Yeah, already you calculated yeah. above. Yeah. Yes. So here. Only 0.99, or mm. oh, let us take one because it's a very small piece. Uh, yeah. Hardly 100 mm is there. So okay. one, one Pascal will be there. Okay. Okay. Next is a uh, taper. Mm. Now for taper, what is the size okay. of the taper? I'll mm. show you the size of the taper is uh, the maximum width is 550, but uh, uh, here it is. Can we can we maintain the same uh, same taper? Like what it is there? Yeah, miss what? I am not understood what you said. So we have already calculated one taper on the other side. Ha ha ha. So yes, I just, yes. I just this said side. we keep we keep the same standard. Yes, 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 yes. Surely we can keep the same because size of the taper is the same. Yeah. So copy this directly and, and paste it. Hmm. Paste here. Simple. Yeah. Correct. Now the straight piece. Hmm. Here. Uh, I'll show you the straight piece like this and the size of the straight piece is what? This is the straight piece. So 450 by 300 is the size. Correct? Yeah. Huh? Yes, yes, yes. 450 by 300. So directly 450 by 300 and this will be the perimeter. Wow. Length is how much? Yeah, length is uh, it is written there. Uh, dimension linear. Take here from here. It is 750. Yeah, yeah. 750. Let us take 750. So if it is yeah. 750, hmm. that is 0. 0.75. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And pressure drop is this. Yeah. Standard yeah. Uh, pressure drop. Yeah. 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 Velocity. Uh, we need to calculate. Though. Yes, we need to calculate the velocity. For one three five zero. Yeah. Point zero eight. Point zero eight standard for straight. Correct, now? Yeah. 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 So this is the FPM. Nine thirty six yeah. FPM is there. Yeah. Miss how much? Uh, uh, point zero zero five. Point zero zero five. That is how much? Alright. Nine thirty six. Nine thirty six into point zero zero five. That is four point seven. Yeah, four point six eight. Four point seven. Okay. Four point six. Four point seven. Let us say yeah. four point seven. Yeah. Yes. So it is six point six Pascal. Yeah. For that straight duct of yeah. this much length. Ye length ke liye, ye duct ka size hai. Correct? Okay. okay. Now here, again we design this one. Matlab ye apne ko abhi design karna hai. Tomorrow we will design this. Okay. And we will take the entire ducting no. as well as. Because okay. my, uh, my static pressure calculation, external static pressure calculation, on always on a main duct, main right. duct. 
So my main duct is this. And then also this, main branch you said. Main in branch. In this is the main branch yes. which is uh, ending up at the reception area. Yes. yes. This is what you have. That's really bad. Understand? Okay. No, very happy. Today was very good actually. Okay. No, no trouble, no headache for you because computer uh -huh. didn't. Play. I'm happy because you know I always. I'm going to send a message to Tirupati. I'm going to send him a message. Uh -huh. I'm going to say thank you very much, say and then this. send me this recording. It will help me a lot. Okay. So okay. by now today. Yeah, yeah. We call it at eight. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Okay. Bye.